Hi, it's Tess and I'm here today because I got my Ipsy bag in the mail. However, when I got it, on here is stamped, and I can't show it because it's on the address label. It says received in bag condition at my zip code. Um, it was open and taped shut, so I did open it. I didn't look in the bag or anything to see what I got, but I opened it to make sure it wasn't all banged up because if it was, I was going to have to do something about it, but it seemed to be all intact um, as far as what a quick glance showed me. So, this is Beauty Scold, is the name of the bag, and it looks like this. It's kind of, I don't know if it was like damaged like that in shipping or what, but it's like totally flat. And there's stuff in it. Um, so the first thing I see is Urban Decay Perversion Bigger, Blacker, and Batter Mascara, which I am so glad I got this because I love mascara. Like, love, love, love it. So, get sexed up in one stroke. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha ha. That's funny. So let me see what this sample size looks like. Urban Decay Perversion. And this looks like the um, same packaging as the that gun metal. I have a lip lippy sample here, and it is almost the same color. And also the lid kind of for the, um, the real mascara. So let me open this and see what the brush looks like. It looks like a traditional mascara brush. So hopefully it's a good mascara. doesn't really smell. So there's that. I'm not a fan of this bag. I don't know. It's like real stiff. It's pretty stiff. Kind of dirty. I'm going to throw this bag away, I think. I don't know. It just doesn't seem... I'm going to dump everything out here, and then I think I'm going to toss that away. I don't like it. Okay, the next thing we got is Lord & Berry Black Silk Mini Kajal Coal Liner. It's a little dinky thing. It's kind of hard, so it might be good on the water line. I have a really, really hard time with things staying on the lot, on my waterline. It is pretty black. I think the blackest mascara I have is my Jordana. Yeah. This is Jordana, and this is that one I just got. So as you can see, I think the Jordana one over here is much blacker. I don't know if the camera will pick that up or not. The next thing I got is the Hollywood California Glam Glow Youth Mud Exfoliating Treatment. I'm excited to get this. Everybody raves about the Glam Glow stuff, so hopefully it's actually good and not just all hyped up on YouTube because they're getting paid to sponsor something, because that's annoying. <laughs> then I got the Mana Sheer Glow Shimmer Lotion Beauty Simplified. I don't know. Liquid that lights up your skin with an all-over radiance mixed with foundation or wear alone. Great for all skin types. Okay. It was practically oozing out. <laughs> anyway, um, lighting is really bad. I wonder if I open my window. If that helps. Now I just look bluer. It, no, wait, is that helping? No. Can you see that at all? No. It doesn't feel very good. It doesn't feel like it's drying or anything. It just feels like it's kind of... I don't like that window open. It just feels like it's... It stinks. <laughs> and then I got the You're the Bomb Green Apple Lip Balm Absolute New York. This is big. There we go. Distributed by Absolute New York. It smells like apple for sure. And it feels really nice. It feels like um, if you, you ever use the Smith Rosebud Salve, it, you can't see it. It's just clear. It feels like that. Like a, more like a I don't know, I want to say like a gel consistency, like kind of 
sticky. You like that, but it smells wonderful. So, overall, um, this bag isn't too bad. Really like the Glam Glow. Really like the Perversion Mascara. Really like the Balm. I'm excited to try this on my waterline. And this, yeah, I'm not sure about this shimmer all over the place thing. So that's five samples, and I'm throwing the bag away. So overall, not too bad. I like this bag. I like the variety of things we got in it. A lot more makeup, which I'm happy about, because I like when we get more makeup than skincare stuff. So thanks for watching, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.